Okay. We are here with Heath, the Australian national champion who was not put on the world team. Uh, what did you think being here and watching the team um, and the, the decision not to put up enough people to try to make an Olympics? Yeah, I think firstly, I was really proud of the guys who competed. I think they put out their best efforts. It was very hard sitting in the crowd. Um, not that I thought I'd definitely gain an Olympic spot here, but I think I rightfully earned the opportunity at least, so that was the hardest thing to sit with. But it's also been a really fun time. It's a new experience. It's potentially diversified my career opportunities. So I think I made the best out of a pretty bad situation and made some opportunities. I, well, what I was most surprised at is like if everyone had asked me every single time they saw me, I'm so sorry you're here, you deserve a to be on the other side with us, which is what every single athlete who saw you in the mix zone did, I would have burst into tears. How did you manage your feelings? I actually haven't cried about it yet. I, I think I processed this a long time, even before the whole appeal process was public and the team I knew for like a month before. So I had a lot of time to sit with it and get the anger out and everything. And as I said, like I'm over here now for a few months and I think there's a lot ahead of me that is gonna be really great. So I'm just kind of focusing on that now. What did you learn being on the other side of the camera? Um, that media can be terrible, not gonna lie. There was like a few interviews with Simone I was listening to and I was just like, these questions are horrible. So I think I learned it was very comforting for the athletes to have me there, on, for me to understand what they were going through and have that empathy, which I think some journalists lack as it is just their job. Um, so that's probably the biggest thing, yeah. Thank you so much. No worries, thank you.